I'm off the Sultani, capital of Sultan country, and yes, that is how it is properly pronounced. Don't ask. Well, a good day, sir. And a good day to you. Let's go, Chester. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. We are going to have to seize this horse from you. For whom do you think you are talking to? We are the Royal Guard of the Sultan, and we have the mandate to seize this horse. Let me speak to your leader at once. Puny merchant, go back to your homeland before I have to arrest you as well. Come. Why'd they do this to me? I'm gonna burn the city down! My Rekka, my Rekka, how thou be, my Rekka? Daddy, I've been saved by an angel. What happened? All I can remember were the hellish flames, so close to taking my life. But God sent me an angel, a knight in shining armor. Who and where is this young knight? He has refused all my attempts to offer him my gratitude. But I have noticed that he is from the Templar's order, a Catholic man. I cannot let this man go without reward. I will bring him to you, my beloved daughter. Okay, Daddy, but I must warn you. I am in love with this man. The heat must have gotten to you, but nonetheless, I will thank the man and give him everything that I own if I must. Quiet now. Young man, may I speak to you? What is this about? Are you the Templar who saved my dear Rekka? I don't want any recognition. I did what had to be done. Young man, I owe you everything for you have saved what is most precious to me. Tell me what you want and it shall be yours. I've already told you. I don't want anything. Don't make me regret saving her. Listen, young man, you are lost, possibly confused. But I can tell you this. You're right, Nathan. You're so wise. Maybe they should call you Nathan the Wise. Don't flatter me. Just come. She's waiting for you. Okay, let's go. Fortune Teller, I heard you could do magic, and magic is what I need. I know what you are, and I know what you need. Tell me, woman. You will not win this war. And if you continue on this ridiculous quest, you will lose loved ones. You will- Enough! Enough! I don't believe a single word you're saying. Prove, prove it to me that I can trust you. A deer will come meet you in the market square in just a moment. We'll see about that. Go kill that deer. Take pictures. Take pictures. Oh my lord, this is true. Tell me my fortune. Tell me who the Templar is. Tell me now. I have written your fortune down on a piece of paper and I have it given it to a man who just passed by. Why would you do this? Mistrust will be your downfall. Who is that man? Nathan the Wise. I have convinced the Templar to come and see you, my precious daughter. He should be here soon. That must be him. I have some other business to attend to. Thank you, Daddy. I will never be grateful enough. How good it is to see the man who saved my life. And how pleasurable you are to my eyes. If you were a tear in my eye, I would not cry for fear of losing you. I'm not who you think I am. <laughs> yes, you are. You're Nathan's daughter, the one I love. 
can't stand this any longer. This chicken haunts me. I'm not Nathan's daughter. I was born a Christian girl. That's okay, then come back with me to my country, and we'll marry you, and you'll be Christian once again. Are you Nathan the No, he has left. The, su the Sultan has asked me to fetch him. Are you his daughter? Yes, I am. Could you go fetch him for me, please? Yes, I'll be right back, sir. Hello, sir. How may I be of assistance? Nathan the Wise, I need you to come with me to the Sultan's place. He has requested to see you. If he requests it, then I shall follow you, young man. Are you there, Nathan the Wise? Yes, it is me, sir. I believe you have something that belongs to me. What could that possibly be, Your Majesty? A few days ago, a fortune teller gave you a paper. The paper contains some very important details about my fate, and I wish to have it back. I'm afraid I can't give it to you, sir. The woman ordered me not to give it to anybody under any circumstances. I'll give you all the riches you want, Nathan, but please do give me this paper. Because I am wise, I will give you a riddle. If you solve it, then you shall have the paper. Two fathers and two sons went fishing one day. They were there the whole day and only caught three fish. One father said that it was enough to feed all of them if they each have one each. How can this be possible? This is the hardest riddle I ever had to solve. Oh, I get it. It's a grandfather, a father, and a son. Here, you may read it. I knew I recognized him. I knew it. My nephew, bring him here at once. Sultan, you wanted to see me? Nephew, don't call me that. Nephew? I don't understand. There's one problem. I am one of the sacred Templar Knights, and I have sworn oath to my country and religion. This war must end if you wish to have me by your company. Sadly, Templar, that is not all. Rekha is your sister. I don't know what to say. She's so beautiful. But if this is true, I must remain true and sincere. Love me, sister. I do love you. Your Majesty, I believe this war has come to its end. Such a long and costly war should only be celebrated by a newfound alliance in which the most unlikely of countries could ever spark friendship, belief, and tolerance. You are right. And as a symbol of my friendship and loyalty to this newfound alliance, I shall destroy the wall, the last thing that separates us from one another. After all, we are all brothers and sisters, and God is relative to the believer. Berlin shall be the country in which the most unlikely events will occur. The most artistic shall survive, the bravest, the harshest, but it is a country to be reckoned with. Do not doubt such potential. Stop! We're going to have to seize this horse from you. Oh, fuck. Stop! Oh, fuck. Hi. I'm going to pinch my, pinch my face. Here you go. Oh, fuck. Hey, Nathan. Stop. We're going for fuck. Yep. Young man, may I speak to you? What is this about? Are you the Templar who saved my dear Rekka? I told you, I didn't want anything. Young... No, no, don't. Epic battle scene! Ready! <laughs> oh God! Go. How good it is to see the men at the same one. <laughs> <laughs> and how pleasurable you are to my eyes. If you were a tear in my eye, 
I would not cry. cry. Ah! <laughs> Go. Hello, sir. How may I be of assistance? If he requests it, then I shall follow you, you young man. Both Nathan and the guard walk away. Well, fuck. Go. My record, my. God damn it. <laughs>